Hey guys, I'm back here on this Wilson house. We're just doing a quick follow-up of where the uh, project's at right now. We were waiting on trusses to be built. As you can see, we're setting those today. Um, if you want to, go ahead and hit the like and subscribe button, and I'll have more videos for you coming up pretty soon. Uh, this house, like I said, it's approximately about 9,000 square feet under roof. Uh, right now, they are setting the attic trusses, which will be used for uh, storage and uh, personal belongings for the owner and uh, or extra sleeping quarters if needed uh, right now they're setting uh, the uh, trusses that's over the master bedroom area uh, the flat part on top of the trusses there's actually a two-piece truss that goes on top of the flat part there which will be the peak so that's what those other bundles of uh, trusses setting on the ground are uh, this is the front side of the house which you can see uh, most of the trusses are done set over here except a few of the smaller ones over the front and the top uh, let's go take a look at the inside of the house and I'll show you this front porch which uh, turned out really good the uh, concrete had a charcoal color to it which uh, the owner wanted a stamped stone look which really turned out great uh, we done the same thing in the back back here also here's a look at the inside of the trusses that's set so far also which uh, they should fit let's go ahead and go to the back porch here and i'll show you what it looks like also which is exactly like the front uh the owner wanted the stamp look back here also which carries all the way over to the garage door right there which you can see there uh she has a great view at the back here which she can have you know she's going to end up building another wood deck off the back here this room right here is going to be her enclosed sunroom which will be heated and cooled also which will have a great view out the side here uh, with all of her windows she's going to have this is the this is the going into the side of the house there with the garage like i showed you earlier as you can see they've got most of the trusses set on this side uh, they're getting ready to take these other trusses to the back part of the house over here which uh the sky track and the framers fixing to pick up as you can see right now um, which that comes in very handy on a house at this size when you need to move materials around uh, to different sides of the house trusses plywood two fours and things like that the uh, crane truck driver as you can see there's fixing to move his truck to the back side of the house and uh, we'll go back there in a minute and I'll show you that also um, I'm trying to think he's got probably about eight ten trusses right there he's fixing to set in the back uh, here you can see to the right over the sunroom uh, we just got these trusses set they also brought some of the one by ten uh, boards right there that's wrapped up uh, which will be placed as the sheeting on top of the house I just think that gives it a better look and uh, strength to the house better than you know chipboard or OSB uh, let's take a look inside the garage here i'll show you the acid stain floor that the homeowner wanted as well um, she went with a a darker look on that try to match the uh, outside of her porches the best she could which whenever it cures up more it will it will have a better look to it right now it's kind of dirty but uh hope to see you soon on some more projects and i'll be having some more videos on this house along with other ones coming up pretty soon and uh hope to see you soon just like and subscribe all of our videos and i'll see you next time